Hi everyone, good morning, welcome to another vlog. Today I have Kirsty down from home, she's not here though. Um, if you don't know who Kirsty is, she's one of like my home friends. Um, you might have seen her on this vlog channel, she hasn't been on in a while, but she was in like literally my first ever vlog I uploaded onto this channel. But today we're going to be going into Covent Garden first of all, get something to eat, have a walk around, because Kirsty's only been to London like twice. What have you done? Oh! Introduce yourself, no pressure. No, I'm James. <laughs> this is James, this is Ben's friend from home. Me and Ben matched accidentally by like bringing home friends up at the same time. I'm really ill. Oh yeah, Ben's really ill by I the way. I am ill overnight and I'm gonna die. He's this ill and he was like, I think it's because I've been breathing through my mouth all night. No, I've got a dry <laughs> mouth, dry throat or whatever it is and I think it's because I've got a nose. <laughs> oh god, please just don't pass out today. But yeah, I'll show you Kirsty when she comes down, but I think she's just upstairs. The Uber's outside, so let's go. Oh, also one last thing. I've got the Yeezys on. I genuinely love them so much. Like, look how tan my ankles are, and they are very tanned. However, tanned ankles make shoes look like 10,000 times better, so that's why that happened. Here she is. <laughs> this is Kirsty. If any of you do recognize her from other vlogs, how many vlogs have you been in? A lot of the times I'll film and never upload them, so I, I always lose track, but here she is. I've never seen a car charge in person before. That looks like so much effort. Like if they had to charge it and now they have to make themselves busy whilst it charges. Anyway, deep thoughts with Millie. Here we are. If this isn't my mood for Monday, I don't know what it is. What day is it? Saturday. It's not my mood. This isn't a mood for Saturday. Saturday's supposed to be a happy day. Shit. Um, I forgot to vlog my food again. I had a burger. It was really nice. Did you enjoy your food, James? Yeah, it was so good. How was yours? How was your? Oh, nothing's changed. <laughs> Still a so-called Monday mood, yeah. <laughs> yeah, this so-called Monday mood we speak of. We're at Selfridges now. I'm probably gonna get told off for filming at some point. That happens all the time. We're looking at the shoes here and they look so strange. Oh my god, I think I put this in like one of my other vlogs as well. But I'm looking at these shoes and I was like, these look like the shoes that one weird kid wore in the pool when we were younger. Crazy how the person who made these, Isabel Moran, is probably like a billionaire because of these like designs. Thanks so much. So now it comes like a cute little cafe in Selfridges. And um, we had a look around the shoes. I didn't buy anything. I looked at some Giuseppe shoes, however, they didn't have my size, so I didn't get them. So now I'm eating. What the fuck have we just ordered? <laughs> <laughs> that looks weird. Yeah, it looks good though. Yeah, I ordered the food here. I have no idea what it is or what I ordered, but it has nothing in there that I don't like, so I just ordered it. Just realized what it tastes like a giant Ferrero Rocher. That's literally what it is, but it's so good. Like, it's got like vanilla cream, ice cream, hazelnuts, like that chocolate that you get in Ferrero Rocher's. It's so nice. Are you enjoying it, James? Yeah, <laughs> I approve with the diet coke choice. Same with me as well. Them women over there are literally who I want to be in the future. Like they are probably extremely rich, probably don't work, and they are literally just like out for a meal with their equally as rich friends and their husbands on know each other as well. I feel like I'm seeing like desperate housewives in real life, but I'm like so into it. I'm like absorbing every second of them. I couldn't even hack it. I couldn't hack it, guys. It was too much. But yeah, this is the cafe. It's such a nice vibe. Naturistic, very natural. I think I just, I don't know what I'm saying. I give up. Imagine having your phone and like holding it over the escalator and then you accidentally drop it. Like it goes so far. Oh, actually we're not as far down as I thought. I'm holding on to my camera for like dear life right now. We're in like the shampoo and conditioner hair like section. I just have a little story to tell because I came here like um, a few months back and I just wanted some shampoo and conditioner so I could like wash my hair in like the hotel shower. So I got there, picked up some that looked cheap, went to the checkout and they were like, that'll be 200 pounds please. And I was like, what? So yeah, moral of that story, always check how much things are in Selfridges. Um, so the Uber cancelled for the way back, so I decided to get my eyebrows threaded because I haven't had them done in ages. And even though my eyebrows aren't dark, having hair like that still stresses me out. Hi, so I did get my eyebrows tweezed slash threaded in the end. However, I couldn't film it. I was in a lot of pain and I wanted to get it on camera, but I couldn't because Selfridges have a no film policy. So I can subtly get away with filming at Selfridges. But the woman that was doing my brows said that I couldn't. So that was great. Yeah, it hurt a lot because I hadn't had my eyebrows done in like five years. Well, like six months, but like the hair had fully grown back. It was, it was painful, a lot of hair came out. I feel bold on my face now. <laughs> if you want to know how my eyes look when I was getting my eyebrows tweezed and plucked, this is what they look like. <coughs> I've been coughing for the past like five minutes so my eyes began to water. 
Okay, so we are off out now. <laughs> and in honor of just having my eyebrows threaded and plucked, I'm going to put underbrow highlight on, which I know doesn't sound amazing. However, after not exactly, see, that's how I'm feeling right now. Because after having hair under my eyebrows for so long, which meant I couldn't put highlight on underneath, I'm now clean and fresh. So it's going on. <laughs> okay, it's come to that part of the vlog that you probably clicked on for because I probably use this as the title. But then we are going to the shard now. Kirsty has no idea. I thought she would have figured it out, but I was like, do you know? And she was like, no, I don't know. I was like, oh, it's just a, like, a random place. Um, so she has no idea and she's never been to the shard before, but she knows what it is. And we've talked about it before as well. Like, oh my God, let's one day go for a meal there out of nowhere. And now like a few years later, now she's come down to visit her whilst I'm in London. I'm going to take her there now and like surprise her. We're just going to go to the bar area for drinks because it's such a nice area and the views are amazing. <laughs> I just said the view's amazing when it's cloudy and pissing itself down outside, so the views probably won't be that amazing. However, she's only down for today and she's going back early tomorrow, so this is the only time we can do it. So, let's go. Didn't see you there. <laughs> We're just on our way for afternoon drinks. <laughs> Why is the lighting so bad? Of course, I get a few cocktails for this evening. So, um... <laughs> Ooh, I'm really picturing it right now. Yes. I told Spencer where we were going, and he decided it was something that he could never miss. So he's coming along oh, now. I was in my pajamas about 20 minutes ago. <laughs> and now he's all dressed up. Oh. Oh. Are you excited, Kirsty? No, I am. Do you have any idea where we're going yet? No. 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 No, no clue. So this is going to be exciting. We're going to Sainsbury's. <laughs> We're gonna do our weekly shot. Do I give you, you my jacket? Be a bit more careful. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> I'm so She just... was so weird. Exactly. <laughs> yeah. There she is. Oh That's god. where we're going. Oh my god. What? <laughs> this is where we're going. It's I... called. It's called. <laughs> Sainsbury's. <laughs> yeah, we're gonna have a cute little drink at the shard. Oh my god. Whoa! Do you know what? <laughs> She's so pretty. We're going to the Oblix because it's like a New York inspired skyline. I've never seen it before, ever. Okay, so we're at the Oblix. I don't know how you pronounce it. Now. The views are literally bad. We haven't picked the best day to come, as I said, but they're actually not bad. And like, obviously, everyone here's like got some kind of story to them. So, me and Spencer and Kirsten were just saying, like, our favourite thing. <laughs> Our favourite thing to do is like look around and think about what everyone's situation is. Like, are they on a date? Are they related? Is the date going well? Is it not? Are they rich? That's the question, you know? And it's an interesting game. We're outside the shore, as you can see. How do you find it, Kirsty? It was so good. What do you think of the view as well? It's actually incredible. Had you ever seen London like that? It's where you've been like twice. No, it's amazing. Wow. I know. Mission accomplished, am I right, ladies? Ladies, yes. <laughs> Back home now. I literally tidied my room yesterday and already it's this messy. I literally just can't be asked. <laughs> Hi, I haven't really been vlogging much tonight. However, I've just been sat chilling in the kitchen, listening to music, planning out videos, planning out like gym routines and stuff like that. Just getting like all facts written down and researching basically. So it's been kind of boring, which is why I haven't vlogged much. But that is the end of today's vlog. I hope you enjoyed and I will see you in another one, which will hopefully be coming soon. If I vlog, I need to tell myself to vlog more. <laughs> Bye guys.